I think a lot of people need to be, you know what I'm saying, reminded of how good Michael Jordan was, including myself, including myself. Do what I say. I know the basics about him. But I really want to know how dominant he was, especially in this era. You know how crazy it is to be dominant in one of the, 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 the uh, what's the word I'm looking for? But you get what I'm saying. Like one of the craziest eras of NBA history and to just destroy niggas. You know what I'm saying? So let's get to how was Michael Jordan? How good was Michael Greatest Jordan player really? of all time. For a lot of us, he's the reason why we became Bulls fans. He was a player unlike any other an icon, a legend, a man who globalized the sport of basketball, and of course, every kid wanted to be like him. But as the years go on, new superstars have emerged onto the scene. It's easy to often forget yes, it how is. we fall victim of recency bias and forget just how great Michael Jordan was. Yes, sir. So what's going on, everyone? You were listening to Bull Central here. Hope you're all doing well. Okay, really quick, guys, before I get into this video... And this was a fun one to make just because I'm such a huge Michael Jordan fan. But as you know, the Bulls are taking on the Pacers tonight in Indy. And yes, you guessed it, since we still haven't had a winner predicting the score of the game for the $100 gift card Goodness. giveaway to Amazon. Ooh, come here. The retailer you guys had voted on. He learned on. that. You, you, trying to I, I tell you who you got that from. Gift card giveaway. He got that RPP, RP pistol. You know what I'm saying? That was a signature Amazon. move. The retailer you guys had voted on. We're trying to go Damn. for it one more time. And I have to think we'll find the winner tonight, given how close we were the last two times. The, the person, in my opinion, to get closest to him is Kobe. Like, like bro, Kobe has five rings. Like, how is that a question? It's Kobe, bro. And LeBron, I got LeBron my top five. I'm being real. Kobe, for sure, is the only nigga that he was like, yeah, this thing is a king. LeBron, I mean, this thing is a king. Kobe was the prince. You know what I said? About to overrule this nigga. So if you're new to the channel, all you have Kobe to do is was give the like total that. score for each team in the following Not people, I think if people forget the about that, score too. Of the game. I will be sending you a $100 gift card. And guys, I'm going to sweeten the pot a little. If we get 300 likes on this video, just 300 likes, I will do and make it two hundred dollars. So let's see if we can he get like to that amount. Triple clutching get that the bitch. YouTube algorithm going, so more people have a chance to give their score predictions, and let's hope we can get a winner tonight. But anyway, back to the topic at hand, Damn. guys. I'm sure most of us saw the documentary Last Dance that came out last spring. Yes, and we it did. was an incredible documentary. It really it was the dynasty of the Bulls in the '90s. I highly recommend I, it. I gotta watch I it again. I'm not gonna lie. It. And it was also a good reminder. Just how good that Cash. team was. And, oh of course, what an incredible athlete Michael Jordan was as well. But all of the highlights aside and the championship celebrations Cash. we've seen, I feel some people still uh, don't oh, oh, Wait, 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 wait. We've seen. I feel Yo, some this thing just dunked on three people. Oh. Don't fully grasp just how great oh. I hear. Oh, he sauced. He sauced. He sauced Larry. Crash, and that's why he was able to win so many. What? What did he say? People saying that MJ's competition was trash, and that's why he was able to win so many championships. I know that you much. Know how Come on, LeBron bro. James has been doing uh, it's far more impressive than what Michael Jordan. Did. What? Oh my God, I can't, bro. My ears are about to bleed, bro. This is right now. The NBA has not been in a worse state. You know what I'm saying? Offensively, for sure, the best day ever, but defensively, easily the worst. This is a period in time where buckets were primarily in the paint, and he was. I can't say too much about that, because then I'll be chatting. You know what I said? Because then I'll be chatting. But from my assumption, he was getting most of his buckets in the paint. Driving on niggas, you know what I said? Bryant's the same type of thing. Mainly against athletes. literal legends, my gang. That's Larry Legend, my gang. Sauce in these motherfuckers. Between those two and how Kobe's competition. Charles Barkley. Jordan's. Fucking well, Carl really Malone. Great, bro. That, the better that between. sinners now look up to. You know what I said? Sinners that he, he used to cook. Niggas used to look, or niggas now look up to. You know what I said? 
crazy, bro. LeBron James or even others for that matter. Patrick fight, Ewing, like, come on, my nigga. There are a number of reasons, uh, stats or records that just show how good Jordan was and how, quite frankly, there really isn't anyone that can compare to him. Uh, th that isn't to throw shade at LeBron. He's obviously one of the best players to ever play Top five. basketball. And I know some Bulls fans don't agree with comments like that about LeBron. You know, there Top is a five. lot of hate uh, for LeBron across Bulls fans, but I respect his game, <sighs> his longevity, Top five. and how he impacts you know other players on the court. And oh his my team god! Court. But for those right, do you see what I'm saying? Like, bro, in today's LeBron would even survive in this era, bro. And this is one an era where fouls. I mean, they were called, oh, but bro, impacts. it had to be like a real foul. Yeah, you know, other players on the. And court. I guarantee you, yeah, like that. You, I'm not I'm bugging my game. How he impacts that like, shit would have been a foul today. And his team on the court. That's not a but foul. For those who claim that LeBron is better or that Michael Jordan. Come on, bro. Although he was great. It's not even like close. Era basketball, a boring it's not era of basketball close. With low scoring games. Michael Jordan was him. On why MJ is the greatest player of all time. So we know that Michael Jordan is a six-time champ, a six-time Finals uh. MVP winner. Uh, which, by the way, no other star player has done that in the nope. shot clock era of basketball. And I say star uh. because Robert Ory winning seven oh titles as a bench player does. Oh, he almost jumped we over him. He was a five-time regular season MVP. Winner. Okay, Again, I didn't so know that. No other player in the post shot clock era of the NBA. Uh, oh my was a 14 God. Time a 10 time scoring champ, 11 time all NBA player, a rookie of the year, defensive player of the year, nine time all defensive team. Crazy, player. bro. You know, just some minor accolades, no big deal. Now, Against the Grace, that's Patrick fucking Ewing. That's Patrick Ewing, PE. Fact. That players are much more Don't efficient. Don't get it today. fucked up, bro. He's easily the best. Defense. You know, easily. Players get more triple doubles and high scoring games, 50 plus percent shooting on a nightly uh, basis. That's much more commonplace oh my God, come than here, we would have otherwise have seen back before the year 2000. Uh, oh but despite fuck. all of that, jelly. MJ just is still on the them. all time leader in the history of NBA in player efficiency rating. Offensive box plus minus, box plus minus. Now, I know you're probably looking uh, at some of these numbers and saying... Nah, it's, uh, it's what's the face now? It's, it's Jokic, isn't it? Box Jokic plus is above minus, him? box plus minus. Now, I know you're probably ago. looking at some of these numbers and saying, well, this isn't that much of a difference. But if you look at the I don't really care about none of this, though. Top, and still, the top 10 player of all time between these categories, there is a significant gap. Chris Paul. And that person is still 10th all time KD. in said category. I mean, looking at box plus minus alone between Michael Jordan and Kevin Durant, who is 10th all time, it's a 27 Kawhi. increase. And again, I say that ass, if Kawhi wins this year, Kawhi is easily top 10, in my opinion. He's top 10 for Obviously sure. Obviously putting up much more efficient numbers in today's NBA as the defenses uh, aren't as strong uh, as they used to be with no hand-checking rules. Uh, like, the like bro, look at what? Aren't as strong as they used to be. Bro, this no is, and the thing is, bro, rules. everyone's crashing the paint. Everybody, it's not how it is. It's, look here, bro, this, you wouldn't be able to do this. Like, you'll have to stay man. You know what I mean, bro? Everybody used to just crash the paint. And this thing is yamming on five niggas at once. Rules. The fact oh that the my God. could this maul a player nice. and have it be a common foul, whereas today it would be a flagrant two and short with ass. that player likely being suspended for a couple games. It just shows you the difference between what the game was like then versus oh what it is God, now. And Michael Jordan what? also leads the league all time and win shares and is second behind LeBron James in value of a replacement player. I don't care about none of this. A bunch of advanced stats because Thank I know you. a lot of people don't like advanced I don't stats care about any of this. Of those oh my god, like bro, every time I think it's bro, I just keep like seeing some crazy shit. So Yo my goodness. For you with a bunch Yo. of advanced stats because I know a lot of people don't like advanced stats and it's fair. Some of those can be a bit misleading, but everything I just showed where just the regular season stats. What uh, makes Michael Jordan's career so impressive 
is just how impactful he was in the playoffs, particularly <gasps> in the finals. First off, no other player in Bro, NBA history, what? I mean, besides Scottie Pippen, oh of course, God. has won 100% Jeez, of their finals. That's Patrick Ewing! That's Patrick Ewing! That includes guys like Kareem, Magic Johnson, LeBron, Kobe, even Bill Russell. I'm about the to day. Puke. Let me be clear, that means players, you know, who have actually seen more than two uh, because you know, it wasn't like MJ went to one finals and won once. No, he won six times to the finals and crazy, won all man. of those. And he did it in less than seven games every Insane. single time. Jordan still holds the record for most uh, points in a playoff game, which was 63 points he had against the number one seeded Celtics. What? In a playoff Whoa, game, which was 63 what? points he had against the number one the seeded Celtics. Greatest layup ever. That's the switch here. Celtics. <sighs> He this still has a standing cold, record bro. in the 1991 NBA Finals versus the Lakers when he scored on 13 consecutive field goals without a miss, which is a finals record and also a playoff record. He holds the most points in a three-game series, averaging 45 points per game. He holds the record for most points per game in the playoffs period at 33.5 points per game. Which, by the way, Bro, it also doesn't, holds the it doesn't regular touch season me. record in terms of points scored per game, averaging just a little above 30. And he did it Eyes as a closed. guard, doing all of this as a guard, averaging 50% from the field. No other guard has ever been able to do that in the history of the NBA. Uh. He holds the record with eight 50-plus point playoff games. And even more impressive, eight. Michael Jordan is the only player in NBA history to never score under 15 points in any playoff game that he wow. ever played. And he played in 179 career playoff games. He holds the record for most points scored in a finals game, most first, first half points scored in a finals, and he also holds the record for oh most game winners or go-ahead baskets with less than 10 seconds in the playoffs. Damn. Guys, I could honestly go on and on. There are so many records MJ Dang. holds even to this day and will likely never be broken. I think the other thing that impresses me so much about Jordan is the fact that we Damn. may remember Michael Jordan as such a strong offensive player who could score at will, but he was also an incredible defender, uh, one of the best uh, defensive players in the league during his time. Crazy, one, bro. Defensive player of the year. He was also a nine-time right, all-defensive player. I mean, you look at the top scores and offensive players in the league now, guys like Steph Curry, James Harden, Kevin Durant, Bradley Beal, they can't even compare in terms of the defensive efficiency that Jordan uh, was playing. He was incredible on the uh, defensive floor. He gave effort every minute he was on the court. I know fans and analysts like oh to compare God. players from different time periods, but in my opinion, Ooh. I know fans and analysts like to compare players from different time periods, but in my opinion, there just isn't an apt comparison to Michael Jordan for you know how efficient he was on both ends of the floor, his clutch gene and ensuring he always came out on top when in the finals. The fact that when his teammates you know, he made his teammates better. Maybe not all the time. We know okay. that MJ was a percent uh, on the floor, and that's because he was oh the my ultimate. God, competitor. bro, he's triple clutching shit. He's triple clutching. He's not double clutching, bro. This is triple clutch. Made to have if you didn't. What the fuck is this floor. shit? This thing is an alien. He's an alien. He's an alien. Bro, this is crazy. A difficult teammate to have if you didn't give it a hundred percent on the floor. And that's because Bro, he triple clutch. He triple clutch it. He triple clutch it. How is that possible? How is that possible? To see that from all of his teammates. What the uh, fuck? There will never be another player like Michael Jordan. At all, Not man. Kobe was the only person to get close. He his his nickname should be the fucking and uh what's what's the word? Time. It'll come to me. And uh, what's the Allergic. word? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Imitator. You know what I say? His nickname should be Imitator. Imitator. And the man... You know what I'm saying? Chicago like, he, he he was like that generic... Or no, no, no. He was like that rep shoe that looks so goddamn close to the regular one. You know what I'm saying? But you get close and you actually look at the details, you can see the distinct differences. A global brand. Like, bro, brand. no, there's no anyway, player compared to Michael think, Jordan, though. bro. Maybe I don't you care. Around or we're too young in Jordan's like, heyday, which is at all. Fine. I'm what sorry, you guys bro. Think when you hear Influential all. wise, fucking, bro, it, it's, it's no Same player that Michael compares, Jordan man. He's like on his own pedestal. Guys that we see today and what they do. <laughs> I'm, I'm being honest. 
impressive than what he did. Michael Jordan and Of course, is guys, just, don't forget to leave your score predictions for bro. the game tonight for a chance at $100. Hit the like button. Yeah, and yeah, enjoy yeah. The video. Shut up. And if we get it to 300 Shut up, fool. But yeah, there you guys go. It's obvious. You know what I'm saying? It's so obvious, my gang. It's easily Michael Jordan, bro. It's not even a comparison. I don't know why. Now, this is this is a good argument. Mike or uh, LeBron has had the best career. You know what I mean? Like he's had the best career accolade wise for sure. You know what I'm saying? Like the records he set, uh championships, not even just winning championships, but bro, this thing has been to the finals ten times. Yeah, I know it can be argued he didn't finish up, but bro, that takes a lot of fucking skill to be able to get to the finals ten times, bro. Like, that's crazy. But, um, what was I saying? Yeah, for sure, he had the best career that can be argued, but, like, overall best player is Michael Jordan, bro. It's not even close. I don't even think Mike, what's his name? Fucking, uh, LeBron would fucking survive in this era, in my opinion. I don't. I think he'll get pummeled. I think he'll get bullied, if I'm being real. I think he'll get bullied. Bully, tormented. You did what I said. But, hey, man, that's about it.